welcome to life with Martha. I just want to first of all shout out all mothers and wish them a very very happy Mother's Day. Okay. Secondly, guys, if you're watching this video, if you watch my video before and you have not subscribed, why haven't you subscribed? Please subscribe to my channel. If you like the content, give it a thumbs up. Max, today marks a year that I actually revamped my channel and I'm so very pleased with all the success that I've been having, having sometimes sticking to something and pursuing a goal and even if you've not gotten to a certain level that you desire the, the moment you're just doing what you're passionate about it brings so much joy and this is this revamping my channel gave me so much joy and fulfillment and i'm so happy to do that of course i took a break and um like i said i was doing some construction i'm done now i want to highlight how difficult it is to embark on such an initiative and i want to hopefully start getting back into all the things that i started our healthy journey i am there with all of you all a lot of people are asking me still um, about how we can how they can end up being healthy and um lose some weight in the process but mainly just being healthy because as we get older uh we need to start taking care of our bodies so i'm all here for it and i am going to start that i also have to let you in on what exactly is happening with my hair and just basically going to to just be around doing being me so like i said this channel was about life with martha and it's all about what goes on in my life and i'm very happy that you're here with me just share the video share the video i would like you to share the video okay so in the following clips i recorded a vlog and in there you'll see things that i i, I did on a particular weekend so i hope you like the content if you do please leave a comment below the comments i i welcome the comments guys so please leave a comment for me you know please leave a comment an encouraging word anything at all hello hello it's saturday so i am this is my first vlogish what i'm doing on a saturday i'm going to the dentist oh my god i hate the dentist but imagine my saturday i have to take to go and do that eh? <sighs> anyway let's go okay But first, I need to go and get some cement. I have some guys working for me today. Uh, and I don't have enough cement. So, I'm going to see where I get the cement. <laughs> but my dental appointment is at 9 and it's quarter past 8. Oh my gosh! Crazy. Let me cut the music down before I cannot use it in the vlog. Listen, this thing is so annoying the way this people is parking on the side of the road by that bakery. Oh <gasps> anyway. I'm going to errands first. I hope that they do have some in there. Let's see if errands has semen. No, thank you. Success. Half cement, so I was going to take about 12 bags of cement one time. But the guy that 
I normally use to transport this stuff is not there. Um, let me see if I can call him. We turn this into a get ready thing because tonight I've got a zest party. So it's heavy. So might huh? I'm not sure. I mean, I'm just trying today to see how successful I am at this. Yeah. I got my nails done last night by Mendy's. And I always feel happy when I have my nails um, different colors like this. I don't really like one color um, sometimes when I do just a simple nail I don't I don't feel happy but whenever my nails are nicely colored and brightly colored and I always feel very happy so I went to bed at midnight it was after midnight I had an order of 12 cookies. Now, the problem with cutting recipes in smaller, smaller pieces, sometimes you don't get it quite the right exact measurement. So, you know, we're going to have to work on that. I did the order twice. The texture of the cupcakes was not as tender as I would like it. I have to work on getting the right amount of um, flour to ensure I still get the same amount of tenderness. And I was up already at six to ice them. Ooh, Sunbelt has a sale. Oh. On my way back, let me go in there and see what's popping, <laughs> what's free, <laughs> what's discounted. Um, yeah, so up early. Sometimes I hate that too because you know you're waking up early. You wake up early to go to work every day, Monday to Friday. Then you up again early on a Saturday. Like, oh. But you know. You gotta do what you got to do. But I need to I need to head to this dental appointment because um, these dentists these days they're not in their office full time. And that particular dentist that I'm going to, he has an office in default. Now all that said, I'm very I have a serious phobia um, with dentists. And I, I mean, it's horrible. That sparked somewhere when I was maybe around seven, eight. My mother took me to the dentist, and a horrible experience. I can still, still feel. I'm thinking I must have been older than seven, huh? It's for me to have such a profound memory of it, and. This man extracted my tooth and I mean I can still feel it so every time I go to the dentist this is what I'm thinking is going to happen and it's, it's horrible over the years I went to this dentist in town that I thought was the most perfect dentist ever um, but I, I had to cut links several ties with that um, dental place because um, they no longer suited my needs in terms of when you would like to get the appointments. The service is crappy, really. Because maybe that she has so many customers that they don't have that personalized type of touch. So somebody introduced me to this new dentist and I am so far very amazing. So I said all this to say that sometimes you don't want to try something new don't want to try something new because you don't know 
how it will be but I'm sure if you if you think about it most times that that happened and then you went did it anyway you're like hmm why did I wait so long and this new dental practice actually gives you a copy of your, your teeth and all the issues that they have started or they, they've noticed or observed about it and they give you the, the file they give it to you so now you can see the progress of your teeth you could see which which fillings that you may or may not have to do or your problematic teeth and that sort of thing and they give you a chat already to what what they can do for you these are the dentists it's almost as if they're keeping state secrets. They don't really want to tell you about the health of your teeth, um, where you could have a tangible thing to look at. So it's like you have to depend on what they say to you, but with this new place, and they're actually calling you to remind you about the dental appointment. Um, they actually have an email that they send email newsletters to you. And then, I mean, it's it's just very, very more customer friendly, and I am I'm quite pleased at this time going there. Okay, I've arrived in the city. PCT sir, but what's up? Cash trees. Time to look for parking. Parking. There's actually a lot just next to the dental the dental office, so I think I'll head over there. Um, I always just like to park in a safe place, pay a little, how much? Three dollars an hour. going in the wrong direction oh she's selling hey man hey, hey look at that one self what's the one hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. oh my god guys you'll never believe this I'm only just getting back to my car after my appointment which took 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, almost four hours to complete. Guess what? The worst thing. I had to commence a root canal on a tooth. Oh my God. Oh. So this complete side of my mouth is completely numb. <sighs> Listen. If you want to scare me, tell me that we need to go to the dentist oh if anybody needs support with a dentist i will be right along with you to the dentist i think i need a dentist buddy because my goodness anyway i walked around town a bit for about maybe about 30 minutes i got the thing that i'm addicted to a lot which is coconut jelly but it has to be soft and the favorite mango in the world mango was so i'm heading up um I think I want to get some soup I'm not sure but I need to go and check the progress of um, the work I set out to get done at the house today so let's go wow they cleaned on top of that area has it it looks really really nice Back in the day, hey. so I bought my cow heel soup. 
has been picking these tunes. These tunes are so very poignant and very, very relevant. It's amazing. Okay guys, I fell asleep and when I got home, I was trying to do a few things, you know, direct a few things and um, I just fell asleep so I'm getting ready to go to a 40th birthday party and I did a few um I did shop for a few things in some very classy boutiques in St. Lucia and I'm very impressed with the things that they're offering so the first thing I bought was from Curvy Goddess um, I, I saw them through Instagram and what I saw there was a pair of shoes I didn't know where I wanted to wear them to yet but this is a cute packaging and guess what guys they actually delivered this to my workplace very very customer oriented and that's a very important thing to me and um, so they came to drop it off and how cute are they how cute how cute i didn't see or i didn't know where i'm going to wear them to but i saw these and i just absolutely absolutely had to have them and the party i'm going to is white and touch of gold so very very classy the other thing i bought is from Porsche Life 758 guys very exclusive boutique so I got a white blouse don't know you can see that so I like to iron things huh but so we ironed and so I got this from Porsche Life. They were located in the Valmo building. Okay. And the other thing I got, I actually bought it on Amazon. These white trousers. Okay, so I'm quickly doing my makeup. See, I have my preparation for me to put my wig. And I've done my brows, so... I'm not even sure what I'm going to do yet. So when I do my eyes, I'll be back. In my haste to get hurry, I thought I was recording. I wasn't recording at all. So I'm almost halfway done. I've applied my wig. So <sighs> let's keep going. So guys, wow, that took me longer than I expected, so let me get quickly to get showered and to leave the house. I will show you the complete look when I'm done. Really giving us 
Tin Lucian artist. I've given her some really, really tough tracks over the years. I'm rushing to MNC Home Depot um, instead. First, I mean, ports might be open longer. MNC closes that one. So I'm, I'm heading down there first. Okay, so the sale was super Saturday, so there's no sale today. So the blender that was 186 yesterday is now two, two something, 256 something. So he doesn't want that one. So here I caught this. I caught the blender. So, it's a good thing I came in. So hi guys, I actually went out. I left home because I hadn't cooked anything. So I decided to go out and I'm here at Gosen's. So I'm having my drink and I've made my order and I'm waiting for it. Thank you for spending the two days with me. If you would like this type of videos, I will continue to do them. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!